congratulations. You've opened your own coffee stand, Cafe Calypso. I wonder if I can ch change that name. Your goal is to make as much money as you can in 14 days. Okay, so we can buy things in different quantities. Looks like there's bulk discount prices. Good to know. Adjust the recipe. I pretty much remember, like, this all tracks from what I remember in high school. So I think then that's it. We just quit the... Okay, cups. Okay, if I remember correctly, coffee and milk and sugar go bad or like ants get into sugar milk can spoil and coffee goes stale i think over time um but cups never do so i think buying cups in bulk is a good idea as long as i have money for other things so i only start with 30 bucks imagine starting a business with 30 dollars even a cheap coffee business like there's nothing fancy going in my coffee <laughs> i'm just sitting out some outside someone's uh business office building and offering their workers coffee as they walk by and they're like yeah i guess i forgot my coffee this morning here's two bucks for a cup of coffee <laughs> my poor dog he fell out of his dog bed he's a clumsy butt okay i'm committing to the 50 cups i don't want to go crazy on coffee because i don't remember how quickly it spoils and Milk, I don't think we need a lot. Okay, the first day, I don't think I'm going to sell more than 10 cups, especially because it's not really cold. Um, but it is a cool day, so we, we might sell more than five. So let's say... So I can see my servings down here, which is really nice. I don't have to do, like, a real person math to figure out my uh, limiting factors and stuff. Okay. Oh, and there is an undo purchase button. They make this game so easy. Um, I want to figure out a way to make the most money at the end of the two weeks. I've never made out with more than like a couple hundred dollars and I was proud of it. So I have 10 servings and I'm limited by sugar, which is good. I didn't want to buy too much milk or coffee. So I think we're just going to start there. And I'm new, I don't have a reputation, and so people are not going to come to my coffee shop for like because they know me or anything. I don't have regular customers at this point, I think. I love silly simulator games. I think I'm going to up the price of my coffee to... I have no idea if there's like psychology mechanics in this game like if i do 290 if that sounds better than three dollars to them <laughs> i kind of doubt it but i don't know let's just start at three dollars and see how much coffee we sell i wish i could i don't know how to tell if i can <laughs> listen to this music or not like i don't know what i'd look up um to figure that out Oh, I forgot to change the recipe. How can I forget to change the recipe? <laughs> a lot of people don't think it tastes good. Oh, no. <laughs> so I have a bad reputation, but like that is kind of profitable. <laughs> so I sold out early in the day and I did turn a profit. So that's cool. But I also have a negative reputation. I cannot believe I forgot to adjust the recipe. So happy customers will make like boingy sounds. I don't know how else to say it or like hmm sounds. And then the angry, upset customers will go and make groany noises. And it's great. It's super entertaining. I'm just afraid to have music on. So let's see. Um, it's going to be super cold tomorrow. That's great for business. Make everyone suffer. Just give me their money. Um, reputation is super bad. Cup sold was high price. Oh, you can adjust the price throughout the day, which is cool. And then you have everything set against each other to look at it. And then it looks like all my milk is more spoiled. Okay, adjust the recipe first. We need, I think I remember sweet spot, like the lowest I could get um, all of the ingredients while still making just about everybody happy. But it was pretty high. It's like you have to have everything around here so let's just try this 
Um, and I'll see if I can lower it or if I have to raise it. But you can get away with a lot more if it's freezing. Um, and I think we're going to raise the price because it is freezing outside. 375 Some There were a few customers yesterday that liked the coffee. And it was pretty crappy. So they'd probably pay more and be happier tomorrow. How much is too much? Is 425 That's like Starbucks prices, you know? Not even. That's cheaper than Starbucks. Just as much as we did yesterday. We need more. We're going to undo both of those. Undo. And now we need coffee. So a lot of my coffee went bad. I don't need to buy that much, I think. Yeah. No, we should have... I think we should have at least 20 servings ready to go. Maybe more. So we're going to do undo all of our purchases. We're going to buy a bunch of milk bunch of sugar a little bit of coffee nope medium amount of coffee 17 is good i don't want to be overly optimistic and waste ingredients if i was smart i would do a spreadsheet of how much ingredients cost and how much i missed or missed out on profit wise but let's start the day i'm happy with all these numbers did the recipe and bought ingredients change the price Let's get rich. I also can, I guess, oh, they think it's too expensive already. No, come on, it's cold outside. Whatever, I didn't want you guys as customers anyway. Yes, I do. Oh my gosh, I'm changing this immediately. It needs more milk and more sugar. Okay. Hear you loud and clear. Needs more coffee. More coffee and milk and sugar. Wow. Okay. I'm going to make it more expensive now, y'all. <laughs> they heard bad things. They heard bad things about my store. Oh, no. <laughs> My reputation did not get better, but I sold a lot because it was freezing and it was overpriced for sure. Um, all my milk spoiled. How many cups did I sell? So I had, I I bought 17 cups worth and I sold 16. So I think that was the best case scenario for the lowest ingredients I could buy in selling and like not wasting any of them at the end of the day. Um, tomorrow is also going to be pretty cold, definitely not freezing. Let's stock up on cups. Um, and I think, do I think we'll sell 16 tomorrow? Probably. But we have to increase all of these. And then I think I need a better reputation. <laughs> I kind of want to start over already, but I don't want to, I don't want to be hasty. I feel like I remember this being 1.7 or something. I don't remember what these, what I had decided these were. But they didn't like my coffee being 425. I think I might have to in increase the price over $4 after I have a better reputation. They might go for 375. I will decrease it if it doesn't look like we're selling well. 16 servings, I don't think we're going to beat that. I'll just play with buying less coffee. Yeah, I don't want to waste coffee, so let's just buy that much. I'm going to predict that our reputation goes into the green a little bit today. Numbers, I know, I love numbers. Spreadsheets are my jam. Hey, most everybody's happy about the price so far. She says that's the good strength. He heard bad things. You know what? Don't listen to everything you see on the internet. Go get an opinion. Educate yourself. Just kidding, you're going off of the best information you have. Um, I guess I am trying to be the capitalist tycoon in this game. I'm not I'm not trying to make friends, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so everyone was happy with the recipe, so I'm going to lower everything slightly. Um, profit margins and see if everyone's equally happy with it or if we need to go back. <laughs> Exploit the people. Only in this game. Outside of this game, you know, billionaires were coming for you. I think we're good to just start here. I wonder if I need to lower my price because 
it got warmer. But some people are coming for my reputation, so let's just start at 375. <laughs> Going down 0.1 in each ingredient category for the recipe made some people unhappy already. And we'll leave milk alone. They were happy with the milk. Maybe I can bring milk down 0.1. It's, you know, we, we're times is tough and we save money where we can. We're just frugal out here. Tomorrow, same temperature. We start at 7 a.m. I feel like that's not very good for a coffee shop. Um, how many did we sell yesterday? If it's the same temperature but higher reputation. This is, is this tomorrow's? Oh, this is day five. Hold on. Is the temperature going to be tomorrow? Is this it? But we sold 14 on day five. I'm a little confused. You get 14 days in total. So you play for, or you uh, sell for two weeks. I'm a little confused on what the temperature is going to be like tomorrow if tomorrow is day six. Mm. Well, we sold 14 either way the last day, so let's. Maybe I should keep the price the same. We may. We have. T it would be better to sell some extras and lose like a couple dollars throughout the day. We'll just see how this goes. They already want the price to be lower. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Ouch. 325 then. Um, whenever I played this in high school, you could not bamboozle people by like raising, like keeping the price low and then once they make their decision to buy, raise the price really quick. I have tried it and it does not really work like that. Um, stock up on cups, never want to run out of those, those never go bad. Let's see. Probably max out all of these because it's freezing and that is an extra gold day. No one, I don't think anyone complained about the recipe this time. So I'm just gonna leave everything on the recipe. I have 18 servings, but part of me thinks that we would beat it. I'll just increase my price <laughs> so that fewer people will wanna buy, but there's still plenty of people bound to buy. Do I think 18 people will buy it for 75? Kinda. We are being capitalist tycoons today. People do want more milk and coffee though. That surprises me. Maybe for the price they think it should have more milk and coffee, but I'm okay with that. My reputation is still going up a little bit. That's like kind of a lot of upset people though. Tomorrow is also freezing. Good day for business. We're just gonna buy a bunch of everything at the top tier and we have 20 servings. I don't think we should have more than that, but we are going to add more coffee and more milk. That might be okay for tomorrow. That might make people happy enough to increase my reputation. I don't know if I should be speedrunning the reputation at the very beginning by, by having like a day or two of really cheap coffee that impresses people. Everyone's unhappy about the price. But I, <laughs> I need enough people to be happy about it. Most people are just coming in for the weather, no. Though not my reputation, not my prices. 
but a couple are pleasantly surprised, you know, and and it's those few that just keep you going as a business owner. Oh, one person became, came because of my reputation. We broke the $200 mark, and I guess that's a big deal, which we must have done on day eight or seven, day seven. So that's cool. Or I will, I should remember that for next time. The next time I play, I need to break 200 before day seven, I think. Um, tomorrow is super cold. So we're gonna, what do I do? Let's just try this. How many cups did we sell? 16. That's one of our higher days. How do I sell more? I hate seeing the red boxes. I wanted them all to go away. I want to make everybody happy and still also make buku bucks. Even though it's cold, milk doesn't last for very long here. This must be bougie coffee shop. They're gonna be less likely to buy on a warm day. So I think I'm gonna have to lower my price here, but I have a good reputation I don't know how many people that actually drives in. I should try and pay more attention to that. Okay, I think we're just going to start at 16. I would be surprised if we sold more than that. You know, that relatable moment when it's 67 degrees and sunny outside and you could just warm up with a coffee. I think I'm selling decently for the temperature. I suppose I could decrease the price a little. It's way too late in the day for that. I should have done that a lot earlier, but hey, we sold some. <laughs> I made $5 today. I don't think I love that. Okay, if I sold coffee for $10 a cup, sold to a third of the amount of people, I would still have to sell to like three to six people every day. <laughs> no one likes the price so far. No one likes the price. No one's using the cold. Going down to $8. Wasted two hours on that price. Anyone for $8? Anyone for $8? Nope. How about... Seven dollars, anyone for seven dollars? Seven dollars, get your coffee. Oh, we got one person. <laughs> That's not enough, two people. Okay, this guy, I should name him Jeff. Jeff likes the coffee. Well, I guess I don't know if he likes it yet. He said it has enough sugar. No one else is buying six dollars. Now we're, we're under six dollars. Come on. This was a total bad idea only a few people have bought is that three did i sell three today <laughs> that's so bad all my milk is gonna go bad we'll sell 14 at this price but let's see if we get to 10 i'll raise the price a lot more if we sell 10 i'll raise the price so that it kind of evens out how much we'll lose Few people are happy with the price and a few people are sad about the price. So I guess that's what I want right now. Why is this teaching me a little bit about business? And I'm already a business owner. Like I'm like, hmm, this is how economics work. <laughs> I play coffee shop. No, oh, I'm probably running out of inventory. Let's increase the price. So people are still buying for a high price. My reputation's good, I think. I'm running out, so we we're charging almost seven dollars, and people were buying and happy. And it's closer to the end of the day, but we still probably could have gotten a couple customers. So I think, hopefully, tomorrow is cold as well. It's very freezing outside. I think we're going to raise our prices a lot. $7.25 for a cup of coffee sounds good to me. I think, I don't know, I'm afraid to change the recipe. I don't think we'll like save a lot of money in the long run. A lot of money. I think 17 servings is, is an okay number. 
You like the lights in the background? Thanks. I don't know if I love how they're arranged exactly, but I really like how they feel, and it's definitely like happy fairy lights that I want in my room. No one is buying. How does this happen? It's even colder than it was yesterday. And they're still unhappy with the price. I was selling coffee for almost $7 yesterday and now nobody's buying. This doesn't make any sense. Stay make as much money as you can. I still don't know how to do that though. I, don't, I still don't know what the best strategy is. I feel like. Like it's not super predictable <laughs> from day to day. My last day, 475 has seemed to be a good number, except that one day. No, I need to sell out. I need to totally sell out. Buy more, buy more, buy more, buy more. Everybody buy, everybody buy. I know it's not that cold outside. my reputation makes me enough customers to make it worth it but if your reputation is bad then it definitely does seem to hurt your coffee shop pretty bad and I should go to bed but this was fun um, I loved how many people came by to say hi and chat that was really fun <clears throat> I hope everybody has a really good night and I will probably stream again, if not tomorrow, then someday this week.